you a good sound. Well, guys. Good morning, coffee beans. It's a beautifully freezing cold day, which means it ain't so beautiful. Beautifully cold, snowy day. It's not snowing now, it snowed yesterday. But it is currently nine degrees outside. And this is what it looks like. Not happy about that. But what I am happy about is these pants, guys, look. I don't know how well you can see, but these pants right here. That size three, four. Okay. When I was 124 pounds, I couldn't fit in these pants. They were too small. I was wearing the five, six. Now that I'm 131 pounds and now I can fit these babies with room. That's just the power of proper nutrition. So I'm not going to go into all that because this is my vlog. But I'm just saying that the nutrition is real. It's real. Like my body feels fantastic to the touch. And just how I feel in general is just ridiculous. And I just, I'm, I can't even believe it every day. And I, I live in this body every day. And I'm just like amazed every single day at what this nutrition is doing for me but on that note we're getting ready to go to church and I am uh I gotta take my vitamins my vitamins are in my pocket but we're running behind because I'm waiting on Lexi and Aaron as usual so I'm gonna put my coat on and I'm probably just gonna go sit in the car and wait for them my brother's not going to church with me today she, he's going to my friend's church I can't go to my friend's church because I have ministry things that I'm involved in so if I'm going to go somewhere else I need to plan in advance to go so they can know that I'm not going to be there or you know my daughter's doing ministry stuff she works in the kids church thing and I'm, I'm not going to just disappear and not let them know that I'm not going to be here this week so they can't find a replacement so that's the deal today my mother-in-law's birthday is tomorrow so I'm thinking about possibly going down to the farm but we'll see because it's kind of ugly out here So, I don't know. We'll see. I'm going to make my mind up by the time I get out of church, I guess. Yeah, let's go. I didn't open my gift. This gift is for Christmas that my friend Annette brought over yesterday. And I didn't get a chance to open it because I had so much stuff going on. I don't even know what it is. Here, hold this. I don't know what it is. I haven't opened it. Because you she didn't, didn't tell me what it. it was, anything. So. Why would she tell you what's your Christmas? You know, because it's like weeks after Christmas. Aww. Aww. Prayer journal. put this picture that I never could put in a, a frame every year in this, where is it? I bet it's sitting on this table. Where's that picture at? That Christmas picture of us. Normally it's sitting on this table. Oh, here it is. Look at this, this picture. Every year I just put it out. It's a terrible picture. For Christmas. I love this picture. I always stick it between something. But now I got a frame to put it in. It's awesome. And then. Mm -mm. I'm taking a new picture. Well, we didn't take a new one this year, so that one's going to stand. Be bold, be brave, be courageous. Joshua 1, 9. This is beautiful. It's got uh, verses at the top of every page. Thank you, Annette. Thank you, dear. I really like it. I love it. I love I it. I'm going to text you and tell you. But uh, because you weren't looking at me. This is really nice, guys. This is really nice. I really like it a lot. Mm, I'm going to have to call her because she's probably going to be late watching this vlog or probably ain't going to watch it until I tell her about it. But this is really nice. Very nice Christmas gift and it will be put to use. Let's go. You got to go like this. Ready? You have to look what 
I'm gonna set this up. They want me jumping on top of this thing. Well, let's see. I jumped on it already. Yeah, I do more than one, Mom. Wait, do. I need to do it. Here we go, Pike. I don't jump on oh. it. Oh. Ow! 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 Make a dog food, Ryan. You know, snow for a building is hard work. Whew. But 
that was my first snow fort. I never built a snow fort before. I, we made snowmen, but my husband's always been the snow fort building with his siblings and stuff when they were younger. So, and he's made them with my kids, but I usually don't go out in the cold to participate in the snow fort building. So, my lips are stiff. It is cold. I got whacked in the face with a snowball by my daughter. So, yeah, yeah, it's going pretty good. It's going pretty good. We're back and the snow fort mode is there. I think we have to let it sit so the snow can get a little firmer or something before we can dig it out. So that's where we're at with that. So I will show you guys the finished product when we finish with it. I'm going to go in the house and get some grub because I'm hungry. Then we're going to get on the road to go see my mother-in-law. There it birthday. is, guys. Snow fort. It's raining out. actually not that bad out here let's take a look inside of the snow foot this is pretty cool pretty cool no pun intended Chicken and artichokes. 